hello guys and welcome to rise and shine tv remember to subscribe and don't forget to click on the notification bell so that whenever we upload a video we'll be among the first people to be notified so today we are diving into a rather interesting and controversial topic on the reason as to why people usually get stuck during sexual intimacy this condition is also known as penal captivus and it has drawn a lot of controversial topics on the interwebs so let's look at the science behind it so penal captivus is one of the most rare yet intriguing phenomenon that has puzzled medical experts and ge generated fascination in pop culture where the penis becomes stuck inside the partners during intercourse although this occurrence is extremely uncommon it has been documented in a limited number of cases creating a lot of curiosity to understand why and how this happens we need to dive into anatomical physiological and psychological factors examining studies that help shed light on this unusual occurrence the most widely accepted explanation for penile captivus involves the involuntary contraction of the vaginal muscles around the penis during intercourse. This condition is called vaginismus. It can range from mild to severe, causing difficulty or discomfort. During an episode of penile captivus, the vaginal muscles contract and tighten around the penile shaft to an extent that makes withdrawal temporarily impossible. Erection in the male body is a complex interplay between blood vessels and muscle fibers. During sexual arousal, the blood vessels in the penis dilate, causing it to engorge and stiffen. In rare cases, when a man experiences heightened arousal, the penis may become unusually swollen, which makes it more challenging to withdraw. <coughs> Research suggests that heightened levels of anxiety and stress can exacerbate the contraction of muscles during intercourse. When an individual is anxious, the body enters a state of flight or fight. <coughs> which includes an increase in muscle tension as part of physiological response. According to a 2005 study from the Journal of Sex Research, anxiety-induced muscle contractions can be exacerbated by fear or embarrassment, which can intensify vaginal muscle clenching during an intimate moment, resulting in penile captivus. <coughs> Performance anxiety or the fear of not satisfying a partner can amplify the physical response to sexual intercourse. This can lead to tension in both the male and female partners, affecting their body's natural relaxation. The same study found that partners experiencing performance anxiety were more likely to experience muscle clenching and even difficulty reaching climax. For women, this might mean a higher likelihood of involuntary muscle tightening, while for men, this anxiety could lead to a prolonged erection, exacerbating the risk of captivus. While penile captivus is an extremely rare phenomenon, its occurrence sheds light on the intricate interaction between the mind and body during sexual activities. Cases suggest that both involuntary physical responses such as muscle spasms and psychological factors like anxiety may play a role. Although there is limited research directly focused on penile captivus, existing case studies provide valuable insights. For those concerned about the phenomenon, practicing relaxation techniques, seeking therapy, and fostering open communication may help reduce the likelihood of this occurrence, making intimacy more comfortable. So, so there you have there it, you guys. Have it, guys. Thank you so much for you watching have this knowledge video. And, and don't don't forget to like, comment, Thanks share, for watching. and subscribe. And don't forget bye to bye. like, comment, share, and subscribe to so our YouTube there channel. You have it, guys. Bye bye. Thank you so much for watching this video. And don't forget to like, so comment, share, and subscribe. Bye bye. You have the knowledge and the